If you've ever looked at this label and wondered why someone didn't write the IP address down, or looked at these blinking lights and wondered if they were sending out Morse code of an IP address, then you already know that you need the PLC Tool SIM IPE. Let's talk about the three main features that are going to help you out. <laughs> Number one, assigning IP addresses to new devices. This PowerFlex 525 drive is new out of the box. I'm going to go to assign address and then use boot PDHCP. And at the bottom it says we're assigning 192.168.1.182. And when I plug the cable in, right away it assigns it. And then at the bottom I can press OK to set the static. And bam, like that, we're set and ready to roll. Number two, reading addresses on an unknown device or network. For this one, you can either plug directly into a device, or in this case, we're going to plug into the spare port on the Compact Logics and check out this whole network. From the main menu, I'm going to go to Read Unknown, and it's discovered two devices. This one's 192.168.1.183. It has its MAC address there, and most importantly, we have the model number. So I know this 1769L16 is that Compact Logics. It also tells us a version. That's going to tell us which revision of Studio 5000 we're going to need and the serial number. Press the up arrow, and there's our PowerFlex 525. Number three, change a static IP address. From that previous read unknown screen, I'm going to hit the down arrow to get back to that Compact Logics and press OK to set it to my target IP. Now I'm going to go to the main menu and go to assign address. And instead of using boot PDHCP, I'm going to replace a static address. I'm going to make sure this is the current IP address of the device. Then on the next screen, I'm going to put what I want to change it to. I'm going to change it to 192.168.1.181. And then I'm going to go down to execute replace. And then just to make sure it did take it, I'm going to go back to read unknown. It discovered two devices, and the first one is that PLC. Click here to purchase your PLC Tools SIM IPE. This is going to help you out on startup and commissioning, and when you're out in the field trying to figure out how to connect to an unfamiliar piece of equipment. Here's a playlist highlighting other features of the PLC Tools SIM IPE.